My name is Paula Miller, and I am the leader of the Academy of the Sciences, of which there are two pathways, the healthcare technology and the environmental engineering technology pathway. Gerald is part of the engineering environmental technology pathway. Gerald is unique to Abraham Lincoln High School because he encompasses all that's special about Abraham Lincoln High School. He's highly motivated. He is very personable. Each day he'll come into my office and he'll give me a word of the day in sign language and I will learn it. And then we have a test at the end to see how many words I remember. I was also the coach of the swim team. And each day I would see Gerald get into that swim pool and always do his very best. He always rose, put the rung a little higher so that he could rise to the occasion. And it was so good to see him grow both as a swimmer and an athlete. I also um, was his sponsor of his community service and he was my photographer for the yearbook. Um, and he would bring back such beautiful photographs that really embraced all that he wanted to reflect in the activity that he was um, uh, covering. I would like to thank Gerald for showing me a different mode of communication and making it beautiful and making me comfortable in my way of communicating with him because I think I've grown as an individual through this experience. My name is Gerald Jordan and I'm a senior at Lincoln High School. After graduation I plan to go to Bloomsburg University and I will major in communication studies. Miss V, as we call her, um, had nominated me and I was quite, it was quite unexpected, but I'm very excited about it. There are three people I'd like to thank and recognize who have worked with me for my four years. First is the interpreter, Mary Bose Hayes. She is a wonderful lady and really it's been such a pleasure having her here at school. Also, my volleyball coach, Mark Adamai. He's been just a wonderful man that I look up to. He's been my mentor, and he's been great. And I have special thanks for my counselor, Mrs. Vojevich, who, I would, who recommended me for this award. I want to thank Office Depot so much for this opportunity and this award. Hi, I'm Mark Adamai, horticulture teacher and volleyball coach at Lincoln High School. Gerald has been a uh, member of the boys volleyball team for four years, as well as assisting me as manager of the girls volleyball team for the same period of time. Uh, during that time, Gerald and I have gotten, the, um, gotten along very well. We've gotten to know each other very well, and I've, got, I've, I've learned to respect and believe that Gerald is such a special person and what he brings to this school uh, and to the community and to life in general. He's energetic. He's outgoing. He is, never has a bad day. He exudes a positive attitude um, both in the school and on the volleyball court as he represents Lincoln High School. Uh, I've made him uh, captain of the boys team this year and he's taken on that role and worked hard to be a very good role model for the rest of the team. They, we have a very inexperienced team and he works very well with the team members this year providing a leadership role to um, create, uh, to make sure that the players know their positions, work on their techniques, run practice in a positive way and he's just been a tremendous asset to, uh, to our volleyball program at Lincoln. I don't have any doubt that he'll be six, uh, successful. He, there's, he's, he's going to hit a home run I'm sure. Of that. And he, you know, he will just be fantastic whatever he chooses to do and whatever he does in life, he's, he's going to be a success. Hi, my name is Jane Krinick. I am the department chair here at Abraham Lincoln High School and I'm also a teacher in the Deaf and Hard of Hearing program. I have been Gerald's teacher. I had him when he was a freshman in physical science and now I am also with him in inclusion English class. And I've worked with him as his IEP coordinator and as his department chair. Well, I know Gerald will do very well. He's a go-getter. He certainly doesn't sit around. He's so involved in everything. And so what I would like to say to you, Gerald, is to 
work hard. It's going to be a different world when you're out there. And be happy. Pursue your dreams. Thank you. You're welcome. My name is Nejana Vojevic, and I'm a bilingual school counselor at Abraham Lincoln High School. As a school counselor, I have met many students. However, only a few demonstrated such a genuine intellectual curiosity, courage, and humility that Gerald has exhibited over and over again. Gerald has enriched our school community and inspired all of us to stop and reflect on the society and challenges that many of us need to face. Indeed, he is exceptional in many ways. For example, he is exceptionally determined. His questions are always thoughtful and penetrating. He has a real talent for organizing data and focusing on the most important things. He also does not hesitate to ask for help if necessary. When he sets a goal, he becomes that goal until he reaches it. It is really very rare to find such a determination and focus in a young person. Gerald is also very creative and passionate about learning. For example, he is fluent in English, Indonesian, French, and American Sign Language. He loves computers and he is excellent in animations. This fact shows that he has a purpose and great ability for independent work. Finally, Gerald is very good in working with other people. He is exceptionally polite, considerate, and sensitive. Gerald is not only gentle and friendly, but also good at understanding other people's feelings and attitudes. He is equally well liked among the teachers and students. He has an amazing record of the community service. We are going to miss you when you leave. <laughs> You're awesome. My name is Mary Bowes Hayes. I'm a sign language interpreter here at Lincoln High School. I work with Gerald on a daily basis interpreting his classes uh, between himself, the students, the staff throughout the day as well as after school in um, volleyball and after school sports. Gerald Jordan is a fantastic young man. Gerald represents everything that's great about Lincoln High School. He's a good student. He takes on difficult classes such as AP Calc as well as studying French where he earned top grades in his class and showed that he has a true natural appreciation for language and culture. He's also a very fun student. Gerald has participated in class trips, our dances sponsored by the school, special programs, projects, as well as after school sports where he is the captain of both the swim team and the captain of the boys volleyball team. One of the things that's so special about Gerald is he brings joy to Lincoln High School for many of us. I don't think that there's a student or an adult who doesn't know Gerald, and that's a good thing because it's in a good way that they know him. We pride ourselves at Lincoln High School in being the best of both worlds for deaf and hard of hearing students. Gerald has shown us that we are the best at many worlds. It, whether you can hear at Lincoln High School or you are deaf, hard of hearing, from Philadelphia or from another country, he represents and has shown us that we're the best at all of those worlds. He's from Indonesia and yet has fit in so beautifully with this community. Lincoln High School, I know, is a better place because of Gerald. And I trust that the world will be a better place because of him. It's going to be exciting to see what he contributes to the world. Gerald, you will be missed tremendously. But it is exciting to know that you have so much to give to the world. And I am pleased to be a part of that.